In this video, we're going to take a look at our net window support for our MagicQ Stadium consoles. All of our current range of MagicQ consoles, including the Compact Series MQ50, 70, 80 consoles, also support our multi-window client, but they work a little bit differently on our Stadium Series products. Our MQ500M console has two main monitors and also supports an external monitor via its DVI port on the rear, which of course can be a touchscreen. On the 500M, in addition to these three screens, you can have up to five windows via our multi-window client. On the MQ250M console, it has, of course, its one main monitor for windows, and you also have a display port connector on the rear for connecting, again, it could be a touchscreen monitor to this as well, another external monitor. On the 250M, it supports two net monitors. So how would you set these up? The multi-window client for MagicQ comes as part of a standard PC installation, Windows, Mac or Linux. On my laptop here, I've already got the multi-window client running, as you can see. And all I do, if you've not run it before, once you've installed normal MagicQ PC, it's not a different download, just a normal MagicQ PC download. If I search for MagicQ, you'll see I find my multi-window client. You run that multi-window client as I'm running here. It should normally, if you've already set the correct IP addresses uh, for your console, and your PC, it will find the console. If it doesn't, you enter the console's IP address and you connect it up to your console. Back on the console, there's just a couple of settings you need to check. In your setup window, view system, view monitors, you just need to enable either one or both of your net monitors. On the MQ250M, the net monitors must run on separate PCs or laptops. So with two laptops, you could run your two net monitors. Now to move a window over to the net monitors, if I take something like my group window, let's first of all maximize it by holding my Alt key down and maximizing. Then I'm going to hold my Alt key down and press Setup, which is EXT. First off, we'll take it to my external display port monitor, press it again, has now moved it over to my multi-window system over here. And if this is a touchscreen laptop, or you can use your mouse, you can of course select items directly on there, and it is selecting them on the console as well. So you can easily move windows between these displays or provide yourself a remote, maybe with something like an output window, at the side of stage type thing. On our MQ500M console, this supports up to five net monitors. And unique to the MQ500M, you can have multiple net monitors on the same system. So if you've got a PC that could drive all five monitors, or maybe the PC drives three and another PC drives two, you can have multiple on the same PC. So you can have multiple touchscreens all on the same PC, on the same multi-window client, and the screens going across it. But that's on the MQ500M only. On the MQ250M, they have to be on separate PCs. So that's our multi-window client for our Stadium Series consoles. 